I have a relationship with God. I talk to God all the time. And that's where I get the courage to come and fight this fight. I'm God saying. told me I made Moses and I'm giving you a duty and go do this duty. Right. America needs help. And so I've been sent on this task to come and talk to the American men and say, Farrah Khan had the 1 million man march and we shall have the 10 million man march because that's how big the plight for American men has gotten. It is tenfold. We have 10 million American men who do not have the resources to, to sustain themselves in this place. Man, 10 million can move something. 10 million can change the whole right? the whole landscape of America. But the but the, the, the thing is, the reality is not. And it's not. I mean, look. You, I can meet people directly where they're at right now. If you don't have the, uh, if you're on child support right now, when you get paid, your whole entire check goes to a person that you created a child with and you can't sustain yourself. That's a problem. If a woman can say she has bodily autonomy, then a man has bodily autonomy too. It has to be universal. And so I'm asking for equality when it comes to legislation based on sexual reproduction. I have to be able to sustain myself. I have to be able to sustain my children. You cannot tax me for having children. That's irresponsible as a nation. And they doing that though, right? They're doing it right now in right. every nation in America, hey, in hey, every state in America. Hey, and what I'm saying is we need to get the hell up out of here then. You know what I'm saying? Because 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 it's not happening. What, what, what he's saying is not happening. They or, have or, the exact same laws in every other nation. They follow, they emulate hey, America. Well, what, we are the what? big dog. Guess what? War. Some some mean? some motherfuckers got to be removed. So you're gonna go to war with women? This is this is a, I'm talking no, about I'm sexual talking reproduction. About, I'm talking about a whole. <laughs> See, I'm, I'm talking about reproductive <laughs> no, rights in uh, order to have but a nation. E even that too. You know what I'm saying? Like, so a whole bunch of shit gotta gotta happen. Politics is war without bloodshed, bro. Politics is the is the discussion of dispersing resources, and so. Everything that you say, you have to be able to pack back it up with some type of policy in what you're asking for. Oh, the scriptures is the policy. Oh my goodness. Yes. That's the on what? Because anything that you're saying is not gonna happen in, in until order, in until... order for me to be self aware, I have to understand that I live in a nation of three hundred and thirty million people. My personal beliefs, I have to be able to separate that from actual policy. Like I have to I have to be able to separate my me praying and my faith with actual Act, action with action. I got. I got to meet faith with action, bro. Of course, faith with action. I, I have to. Dead, yeah. Yeah. So I'm talking about policy. I pray. I love God. I love Jesus. Thank you so much. I got to do this work. I got to do this work to, to to save America. To to love my brother. There's one commandment, bro. Love the Lord your God with all your heart, your soul, and your mind. The second commandment is just like it. Love your neighbor as yourself, bro. The, I'm, to live your faith, to do what God told you to do. I'm not going to go dive in and, into some some ancient scripture. I'm going to do this. The, the number one commandment, love my God. Number two, love my brother. I love my God, and therefore I'm going to stand for my brother. What's up, man?